everybody. Nothing. Hi. Hi. Pasta. <laughs> That's funny because it came from another Germany. <laughs> Anyways, first off, I'd like to thank you all for attending the Italia panel. Uh, yay, Italia! Woo! And uh, hi, I am your host, Germany. I'm not going to attempt the German accent because I am absolutely awful at it. Uh, and then we're just going to move on. We're going to introduce all of our panelists, starting from China. You already introduced oh. me. <laughs> Hello, I'm China. No, take it, take it, take it. Hello, I am England. Woo! I am Russia. Woohoo! Bonjour, I am France. I doubt I need any sort of introduction, but I'm Russia. Hola, senorita, senorita. I am Spain. Hey, I'm Denmark. Oh, what? <laughs> Two mics, Denmark. <laughs> oh, you take it away. Yeah, I'm Norway. Hello, I am Hungary. Hello, I am Liechtenstein. Ciao, I am Italy. Japan, this. So first off, um, what we are going to start off with, as you know, I like to have things absolutely organized. So we're going to start off with a pop quiz. Oh, God. oh yay! Who doesn't deserve like another two weeks? And I hope all of you are up to date on your history. <laughs> oh, you bet, Germany. You bet. <laughs> so the way that this quiz is going to work is I don't want any of you guys shouting out questions because I'm going to ignore it. Raise your hands. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna raise our hands and then we'll, we'll pick someone and answer. You know, you, you guys know how that goes. Uh, so we're gonna start off with the first question. By the way, there's prizes. Ooh. Yeah, so if you answer the question correctly, you, you get a prize. So the first question is, when did the Berlin Wall fall? You had your hand up first. 1989. What month? Uh, I think it was um, November. What day? I'm Tim Gets 11. November 11. Well, it's November 9th, but you're close, so you know what? You still get a prize. Yay! Oh, okay. Uh, what is the main river that runs through Hungary from west to easy? East. This is easy. Uh, I am not easy. I will have you know. <laughs> I see Jesus if you try hard enough. Oh. I, I saw it too. Is that Danube River? Yeah. Yes. Oh, Germany gets it right. How many rivets are there in the Eiffel Tower? <laughs> the correct answer is none. But I'll give you guys a shot. Anyone. Anyone? Am I really the most intelligent person in this room? <laughs> yes, you in the front. 2.5 million. That is correct. Oh, there's 2.5 of the rivets? There is 2.5 like million. So 2, oh, 2 million. Oh, okay. They're <laughs> <laughs> not very bad in our Alright. What does the KGB stand for? The KGB, what does it stand for? Nobody wants to get shot. <laughs> <laughs> I like that I get the Russia question. Are you reading that off your phone? <laughs> <laughs> it's still the right answer. <laughs> we can't understand anything about using our resources. Well, I exactly. figured you guys would know. <laughs> you think anyone would know that? It's called a history test. You don't get to cheat. Oh. 
Unless you're in university. You get We're still going to be nice and give a prize. Yeah, we are. Yay! Woo! <laughs> what is the capital of New York State? Oh, God. Um, you know what? Let's go blue hair in the back. Yeah. Stand up so we can see you. Or just yell. Yeah. Albany. Albany, that is correct. Get Thank you, Sardis. Also, I have Italy running around, delivering the prizes. He is on an, ex an exercise regime. I don't like it. <laughs> All right, this isn't written down, but it's an important question nonetheless. Who's the most awesome country? <laughs> All at once. Me! Oh, Russia! Russia! Get it is for Russia! Yeah. Well, a bunch of girls screaming your name, not the first time. <laughs> How am I going to get prizes for that one? <laughs> During the Depression, what country did Switzerland save from starvation? And spell it correctly. Uh, let's go for back, you though. all the way in the back. Yeah. And the second bit? Spelling. <laughs> C. <laughs> Bueno! Woo! Italy, go to third surprise! How far back is it? Raise your hand so I know who you are. Everyone raise your hand. Raise your hand. Can you stand up so we can find you? Oh, let me go. <laughs> France, Is Cardiff part of England? What? Is Cardiff part of England? Uh, I think it's a true or false. Right, let's do, uh, the the, yeah, the black sleeves. Uh, the one with the double ribbon black <laughs> sleeve. No, it's part of Wales. Yeah, you killed that. Good job. <laughs> Who was the last king of Prussia? Not Russia, Prussia. In the back with the white band on your wrist. Yeah, curly hair. Stand up, yeah. Pick Gilbert. Yeah, Gilbert. Wilhelm the second? Yes. Good job, Italy. I'm proud of you. <laughs> what angle was Catherine the Great throne set at, and why? <laughs> what angle was Catherine the Great throne set at, and why? It was the 90th angle, so no one could sit on the throne comfortably. No, that is incorrect. Yes. Uh, 180? No, that would be straight up. <laughs> Anybody? 45. Yes, and why? Mo. Can we give it to you? She answered it half correctly, so let's give her a point. All right, the other half of the answer Who can is. Who answer the other half? Can anyone answer the other half of why her throne was at 45 degrees? There's someone in the back there. Do you enjoy it now? No. <laughs> no, that's <laughs> Italy. <laughs> and Spain. Um, apparently Spain. Spain. Okay, let's read the rest of the, let's, we'll just give them the answer. The reason why her throne was at, set at 45 degrees is because Catherine the Great had a giant pennier which uh, did not allow her to sit at 90 degrees. So she had to just kind of lean back in her throne because of her giant pennier. Mm -hmm. For the uncultured, what's a penier? <laughs> the penier. The penier is those big dresses that go out. Not a hoop skirt, but like the ones that look like a big table that was flipped sideways. Oh, like the ones that Maria Antoinette wore? Yes. There it is. <laughs> we just have the best. Yes. <laughs> Alright, let's go the world. No. Yeah. 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 I think it's the second X to mine, so. 
Lichtenstein. Who at the FNQ? They're a terrorist group in Quebec, and they're fighting for Quebec freedom. Can you say their full name? Oh, I know it. I know it. I know it. No, we'll still give you a prize. Who can actually say the full name of it? Front de la Rasson de Quebec. So we're going to have to give a round of applause to Grand by Rome. Come on. And run faster! I can! <laughs> you can't believe you're my favorite. The British are coming, Italy. <laughs> <laughs> so that wraps up our questions, actually. Um, to everyone who answered it correctly, hooray! <laughs> to the rest of you, you all need to study harder. <laughs> So the next step up is we are going to have an open Q&A that is for our lovely panelists here. Um, however, I'm just going to say, just watch your language, this is PG, so uh, when you're asking your questions, we will keep that in mind. You can also raise your hands if you want to ask questions. <laughs> in the back there. <laughs> Next question. <laughs> Germany. This is for Denmark. Was it like being my hat? <laughs> oh! <laughs> You're my underwear. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go with Mama Grease. Okay, I have a question for Spain. See? <laughs> do you treat Romano like more like a son than you do as a lover? Uh, I am waiting for Romano to grow up to be a mighty fine, but I can't say. <laughs> I'm keeping the PG at 13 rating. <laughs> it's PG, there's no 13 in it. Luxembourg? Is there a reason why you and Prussia are on opposite ends of the table? Ooh. <laughs> She requested to sit beside me, <laughs> but I wanted to sit by Spain and France. See, si. I think this says it all. <laughs> no. Uh, we'll go with you all the way far back over there with the black hair. my siesta time. Thank <laughs> you. 
don't know what people talk about. Who's Canada? Canada. <laughs> Next <laughs> question. <laughs> uh, let's go with the Attack on Titan jacket. Germany. How do you um, deal with your brother's shenanigans all the time? <laughs> <laughs> lots and lots and lots of beer. <laughs> I drink a lot of beer, too. <laughs> In fact, he drinks most of mine. <laughs> That's not nice. Uh, you know what? We'll go with green shirt in the back. Um, this is for, like, you can play those games on the Did you cause any trouble before you came to the <laughs> See. What kind of question is that? <laughs> See. <laughs> Of course. <laughs> I, uh, I found a corgi outside. It licked my face. It was cute. Aww. Is that why you needed the peanut butter? <laughs> yeah. Que fiasco. Uh, what is good with? Prasha. Yeah. Out of all of your shenanigans, which is the one you're most proud of? You know what? There's this one time that uh, the hungry got hurt. It was also really awkward at the end. But I really like. I really like the fact that I uh, ripped my uh, my crotch, my crotch fabric, and put it on her. She didn't like that. I thought it was funny though. You covered me with your tainted fabric. <laughs> yeah. But then you saw my boobs, and you guys scarred you for life. Um, fedora. Uh, on a scale of one to a million, how awesome are you, Prasha? I think it's past a million. What, like Googleplex? Is that the highest one? I'm like Googleplex, so awesome. Uh, you Um, this is for Hungary. Yes. For your pen, do you use ceramic or Teflon? Hmm. I don't know. Which Fresh out, which one hurts more? <laughs> cast iron. Cast iron hurts the most. I was about to say cast iron. Yeah. Hands down, cast iron hurts the most. <laughs> Blue shirt. Yeah. Hey, but can you please say that I will always love you? <laughs> Wait, who's he serenading? No. <laughs> Do it! Do it! Yeah! <laughs> and I Despise all of you. <laughs> I'm not sure how I felt about that one. Uh, your you singing know. is as bad as your cooking. <laughs> yeah, with a hat. Oh. Um, where's America? He's late. 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 <laughs> late. As always. He's At McDonald's? On time. Probably. And China. <laughs> Maybe he's having a You haven't asked a question. Yeah, he has the left What? Who's Canada? I already had that question. You were in. Canada the one that makes the pancakes and the servants yummy. So is that you? You eat everything. Oh no, but they, 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 they have like they, they, this blonde hair and then they just they turn and get Canada's like American and a lot of people. So it's like little America. But half of them speak French, which makes them better than America. Yeah. <laughs> oh, so like, is, is Canada the one I'm always drawn with? Yes. Yeah? yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> you should know this. A portion of Canada is dedicated to Prussia. You should know this. A portion of everyone is dedicated to me. <laughs> Canada, I see you had a question. Who? Uh, I just wanted to ask England, why did you decide to side with America when he was trying to take some of the land from British Columbia? All of a sudden you decide to side with him? <laughs> well, sometimes you're faced with a horrible choice of the lesser of two evils, and sometimes, just sometimes, you have to flip a coin. <laughs> oh! Um, let's go with... Go ahead, let's on Quebec. Oh, wonderful place. <laughs> A wonderful place. Get out. Because we flipped a coin. <laughs> uh, red scarf. Uh, England, how do you feel about your 
Oh, Andy, could you say that again, please? How do you feel about your two feet? Oliver. 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 Well, everyone has their evil twin. I'm just glad to know that mine is real and buried somewhere and out in the field. <laughs> Marshmallow. I know it is. Yeah. No, there's a marshmallow behind you. Would you still think that we're in the United States? Because we're in Canada. Everyone likes saying we're in Canada. I don't know what that is. Ew, I don't want to be in Canada. I don't understand that question. I thought we were in Little America still. Question. Yeah, what was the can you repeat it? You still think that we're in the United States because we are in Canada. <laughs> it's odd that you all have sushi <laughs> and maybe some dim sum. I thought we'd slipped into a parallel Doctor Who universe where everyone was slightly off. I didn't know this was a real place. <laughs> oh, I like this place. It reminds me of Russia with the snow. I like snow, especially jumping out of planes into snow. <laughs> it's a little harder to find good food over here. Oh. It's still a little bit better than America's food, let's be honest. No, no, no. Oh, yeah, 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 better than England's food, yeah. I think, uh, let's say this is like the world's fourth worst food. <laughs> I was told we were going to Mexico. <laughs> Let me get I found out yesterday there was something wrong with my whiskey. It had maple in it, so I figured, well, I might as well go to Land of Maple. He's really hungover. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, we actually found this place first, just FYI, so, excuse Nordics. I, I did, actually, I did, you didn't. <laughs> Iceland! Nordics! Iceland was part of my general opinion. No. <laughs> excuse me. Well, I'm not sure what I am, but I really do like this place. Everyone is so kind, and I actually quite like their cooking, and their frying pans. <laughs> And they're cheap. <laughs> I also don't know where we are, but the place is very pretty and everybody is very nice. Uh, I really like talking to people. They're all very nice to me and they, well, they make, they remind me of Big Brother, but Brother couldn't come. So I think I'm the only one that actually knows where we are. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I had a talk with Canada before the panel, and we, we had maple syrup and pancakes, and then, and then we had a siesta in the park, and, and, and then Germany came and woke me up and said it was time for the panel. <laughs> so that, that, that got cut short. So in other words, you like it because you can be lazy here. <laughs> <laughs> What about Japan? Japan, not here to talk! Japan is just as forgotten. <laughs> Sushi here, no one is good. <laughs> okay, next question. Um, who did not ask a question yet? Hey, I see some people who have actually like, asked questions. Put your hands down. We're going to get someone who hasn't asked this question. Uh, Come on, seriously. This is for France. Does England look dead sexy in a miniskirt? <laughs> I remember when England grew out his hair. I used to braid it. And then I put him in one of my little dresses. He was so cute. Well, oh, definitely. I mean, once you shave the legs, and wax the chest, and the back, and the armpits, it's, it's, it's quite attractive. <laughs> um, let's go for somebody. Uh, you know what, you've had your hand up for a while. The ginger weight. Yeah.
I'm sorry, what? <laughs> I'm so you're gonna have to talk a little bit louder. Ha! I was hoping someone would ask that. Alright. You understood that? I did, yeah. <laughs> what? You didn't if anyone didn't hear, why did I choose to wear this awesome garment today instead of my regular one? Well I wanted to outshine everyone. <laughs> you always do. Yeah. Wait, even France? Yeah. I'm sorry, I had to take him out of the basement at some point. <laughs> so I decided to choose my uh, most awesome outfit for my wardrobe. To answer your question? Um, let's go with uh, the, the fox hat. <laughs> Don't they come from a tree? <laughs> Don't cashews come from the ground? Like, like, little potatoes. <laughs> I like potatoes. I don't know. <laughs> we don't have cashews in China. Did anyone here grow cashews? <laughs> I don't think I do. I don't. Do you have any yes, they are. I think America no, grows them. Let's put Spain on the spot. Spain, don't you grow cashews? See? <laughs> How do they grow? Naturally. Uh, you. Well, Russia, will you become one with me? Yeah. Come become one with Mother Russia. <laughs> Make Italy do all the cooking. <laughs> <laughs> but you didn't need to do the last night. But you can make pasta. And the night before. And the night before. And the night, uh, you know, every night. Yeah, and you also didn't clean the kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> you said like dinner, not clean the kitchen. Two completely different things. When you make <laughs> dinner, you clean up the kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> but you're so much better. Boys! <laughs> <laughs> we work together to keep this household together. Isn't that right, Italy? Good boy. <laughs> I see England has a question. Prussia, I'm pretty sure what's going on with you right now is called a midlife crisis. <laughs> I'm far from midlife, let's be honest here. Yeah, you're pretty old. No, no. I'm a country! I'm immortal. Um, no. But are you dead? I'm wearing my coolest outfit because I want to wear my coolest outfit. What outfit are you wearing? It's the exact same one. Shut up. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna go for you there with the white gloves. This is a question for Prussia. <laughs> Why do you think you're better than you are? Oh. Oh. No. Oh. Let me ask the audience, Helly. How awesome am I, guys? Oh. No. Oh. You gotta be louder than that. I don't know. Like, boom! I don't think people would scream like that for me if I wasn't awesome. I'm putting it back in the basement when we get home. <laughs> that is the sound I hear from Japan all the time. <laughs> Squeeze. Um, okay, you know what, you've had your hand up for a long time. How did you put up with precious shenanigans when you were on the diet with Japan, which meant no beer? Oh. 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 I came out of it uh, with a lot of bruises. <laughs> Prussia, drink all the beer. <laughs> Next okay. question. Um, we'll go for you there at the end there. The, the one that just, yeah, you. Yeah. Uh, England, you have a pet yeah, unicorn. Mine's name is Bob. What is yours? What is yours name? Well, for one thing, unicorns are never pets. <laughs> they are wild creatures that will merely friend befriend people. And Mr. Tiddlywink Sparkle Pants <laughs> at this point in time is mine. Okay, um, we'll go for you at the end there.
Oh, it's not. We saw that, Germany. <laughs> you know what? We'll go for Germany. <laughs> okay, this is a question for all the countries. Is it a common occurrence for uh, the European countries to flip coins on very, very, very big issues? <laughs> well, to add to that, actually, Germany, we did do that for some of our things as well, so. <laughs> no, I, I, I said, to Russia, become one with Mother Russia, and everyone said, no, we don't like you, Russia. Sometimes we don't flip coins, sometimes we do it in other ways. Oh. The other way is called war. <laughs> um, Greece. Germany, do you remember a, a little girl in a green dress? She gave you her oh. panties? <laughs> I ship that so hard. <laughs> Opportunity to claim Hans Island, just saying. No. 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 Yes. Oh. Yes. Yes. Okay, I'm gonna go for one more question, and then I have a little surprise that I planned. Uh -oh. Oh. So we'll do one last question for now, and I'm gonna go with uh, you there. Yeah, you. We all know who the best country is, yeah, but yeah. who's everyone's favorite country, other than themselves? <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, uh, do, do we want to answer that, or I think it would be cool if we kind of like did an uh, audience there. We're all on an anime convention. Now <laughs> 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 yeah, I'm also going to take one more question. I was actually looking at the, the little guy back there. Yeah. years of history says otherwise. <laughs> At least the Scots didn't beat me. Oh! Are we doing this? Are we doing this right now? Are we doing this? We're doing this? We're doing this? Uh, we're gonna do something called the hot sauce challenge. Oh. 